Good morning and welcome everyone. It is the day after Pride and I presented it. I led it. I was at the top of it, the back of it and everything else. And now I'm in Vivian of Holloway, which has got the finest dresses as you can see. Marilyn's red one. We've even got a white one over there. You can come a bit closer here. I don't bite too much. And you can get changed in these lovely dressing rooms. Look at them, aren't they beautiful? The fabric alone costs about a hundred pound a meter. They've got dresses, they can have your hair done, they can do your eyes, your eyes, they can do the hats, these little things here, these little flowery things. They've even got the glasses. Now, I'm sorry, but Marilyn Monroe may have had the figure like I had 10 years ago, <laughs> but these dresses pull you in to make you look amazing. And I know I sound like a horse drag queen today, but once you've interviewed as many of them as I have in the last three to four days, oh, you end up sounding like one. And I wish you all the best in the world, Vivian of Holloway, because it's just two minutes from the station, you cross over the road and you walk down and you meet these beautiful ladies who are glitzed and glamoured in the 1950s. Is that right, dear? And the 1960s, and they've got some amazing lamps, which I think I might have just broke. <laughs> but I didn't break it. I had nothing to do with it. I just told her how to get her money back. And if I could tell you, we've got some very lovely people up here as well. Uh, zoom in, zoom in, get closer to them. Of all the different type of things that they sell, because that, that, that really should be Marilyn Monroe, I think. Well, she's probably someone very famous that my ignorance doesn't know. And if we come up here, look at this, isn't this, isn't this just magnificent? Isn't it wonderful? I mean, Dee Medna herself should be coming here, dear. Look, you've got the lips, you've got the head, you've got everything, you've got the dresses like they have for the, for the, Help me out, dear. <laughs> Where are the dresses from, these little ones? Can you even get them for your baby? The gypsy tops. The gypsy tops. Would they look amazing with the pedal pussers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And look at the trousers. And they can fix them, they can tweak them, they can take my belly in, which used to be size 0, and Mullen for Ralph Lauren. Those, those days are gone now, dear. And I know I sound very hoarse today, but do you know my favourite handbag? in the whole place is this one because it's couture from Paris and it could have been opened by who was that woman that's daughter to Dior or Chanel out one of them look they've got it all here um, they've even got the lamps flown in and look at these were stylish lamps aren't they gorgeous Aren't they beautiful? We've yet to figure out how much they are because they're so priceless. But look at this man here, and he's holding an umbrella, a knight. <laughs> and I wasn't supposed to come in here to do this, but I've done it. And I wish you all the best luck in the world. Now wear me glasses, because I don't want to lose them. I Say happy pride to everyone. Good luck to Vivian of Holloway for all the presents they've just given me. But the one that I'd really love the most is this poodle. And there we say good night and God bless you all. <laughs>